Hey guys, I keep seeing this comment on my ADAR video about what type of ammo I'm using and it got me thinking about a mistake I see a lot of Tarkov players making. First off, my standard mag setup is almost always 25.5A1 on top and 10.56A1 at the bottom. You can also add 995 if you want to get wild. I set the tracers at the bottom to let me know when my mag is running empty and a signal that I'm going to need to swap mags. Here's what I've noticed from a lot of newer players and even some old ones. I'll be looting you guys and find your mags are loaded wrong. Some of you are putting that in backwards. You've got your best bullets sitting at the bottom of your mag and your subpar ones at the top of your mag. And listen, it actually kind of hurts me to say this. This dumb loaded his bullets in wrong. So look. I could show you how to load mags in 5 seconds with Tarkov, but I learned how to sew and made a green screen, so I kinda wanna play with that. This is a P mag. Just to keep things simple, we're gonna pretend that I'm using 762 by 39 BP and HP. It works the same in Tarkov as it does in real life. Whatever goes in first comes out last. In Tarkov, you want to put your flesh shredders in first and then your armor shredders on top of those. Just to clarify, this is only for split ammo mags and it's probably best to load with full BP or armor pen ammo for PvP. This is a Galil. Your mag has a spring inside that moves bullets upwards every time you shoot. Alrighty, hopefully you get how this shit works, or there's no hope for you and you're gonna be a Timmy forever. Just some closing tips I have for you guys. This is my opinion, but I personally think 995 is worse than 55A1 all around. I could be wrong, but you can find that out for yourself. There's plenty of apps. I used to use an app called Battle Buddy on my phone to check ammo stats even though I don't use it anymore and I don't know if it's up to date. Some of you have also asked how I get my ammo early wipe. You should be checking every scav you kill for good ammo. I always do this early wipe to get 55A1, 762BP, and 366AP. I also check the flea for 55A1 pretty often mid wipe, but I think you need level 4 traders for that one. If you also wanted to know how much the ADAR costs to build, it's about 200k according to this. I usually grab an 8R off a scav and replace the junk lower with a 100% lower. There's a level 1 rep offer from Skier. Alright, that's all I've got. Let me know in the comments if you like the green screen stuff or if I should just go f myself and never do it again. If you really like this video, you should consider subscribing as I've got a lot more stuff on the way. Thanks for watching guys, hope you like this one, have a great day. Bye bye!